All right, so after having defined my uh, placement area, uh, what I need to do now is I need to look at the different aspects of the enclosure uh, and I need to start defining some sections. Now, one thing, a little trick that I have is uh, some of these elements are separate components like the rails and stuff like that. And in my case, I'm not really concerned too, too much about the, a lot of detail about it. My main concern will probably be the door, will probably be the back plate, and most likely the enclosure, the lugs, uh, the transport lugs, and all the other little bottom plates and so on and so forth it's not really of interest to me so one tip that I can give you guys is uh, what you can do is basically just go around the panel select it so I'm gonna select the different parts uh, of the panel the side little uh, uh, trims here the bottom plates right if you can if you don't have good access to it you can always rotate it um, I made a shortcut key shortcut is R for me anyway and then you can start selecting different uh, parts of it um, here I'm gonna select this part right here Zoom in on that. Okay, select that one. Okay, now here also what you can do is uh, I'm going to grab the side, not the door, but I'm going to grab the side rails. Here's where your 3D mouse comes in. Would be nice. Click on that, bring that up. Probably going to also select the top part, even the transport lugs. Well, maybe not. I'm going to keep the transport lugs separate. Um, this rail right here. Rotate my views. Grab this sucker right here. Okay. And rotate. The, the back plate is not touched. The door is not touched. The lugs are not touched. So you just go here and everything looks good. Okay. So once everything has been uh, selected, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go under here, edit, and um, here I have, uh, where's the, where's the, where's the graphics, and I have here unite. So I'm going to group all those elements. So I'm going to hit unite. He gives me a little placement handle, and I don't really need to to, wor to worry too, too much about that. I'm just going to slap him anywhere. He's not really of my concern because it's going to be my um, my bottom section, which I'm going to define as the placement area. I'm going to have to do that again. That's the placement area. Fine. Okay, so now uh, if I look at my my um, layout space navigator uh, you'll notice that if I click on one item now he's highlighting all my separate items in here those all items became one so when I select logical item that whole item became one now I can continue along uh, these guys are just my hinges and what I can do is the same operation I can group my hinges together so grab that sucker oops not that and uh, Holding control, of course, that's a uh, basic uh, Windows function. Sometimes these things are hard to grab. Okay, so zoom in perfectly. I just grab all four of them, and I'm going to do the same operation. So under Edit, Graphics, Unite. Just stick it there, it doesn't really matter. So now, Logical Item 1, which is the box. Logical Item 2, which is the hinges. Uh, you can also see that on the, on the preview. Then the other items, uh, that's my door, so uh, that's fine. Uh, this is my lock system, I can keep that separate. Here I have my, my transport lugs, so here are my little lugs, what I can do. Just select that one, that one, that one, and that one. And I'm going to use the Unite again, Graphics, Unite, it doesn't really matter. And what am I missing? Here I got the transport lug nuts and the back plate. So I trimmed it down and now all I need to do is uh, specify uh, what is what. So uh, very easy. What I'm going to do here, this is my my enclosure. So inside my layout space navigator, all I have to do now is just right click, go to properties. And here I need to define uh, the different functions of it. So I can click here the three dots, go to mechanical. It's going to be a uh, housing. It's going to be uh, enclosures. No, no. It's going to be a housing. Oh, yeah, you're right. Enclosure. It's going to be body, body general. So it's the body of the enclosure. That's fine. Hit OK. And also here, another thing that's important, also for filtering most than anything, the trade. It's, this is not an electrical component. It's actually a mechanical component. So you can hit OK on that. And what you can do is, since all of these are going to be mechanical components, I can right away select them in the uh, layout space navigator. Right click here and select that and hit mechanics so they're all going to be mechanical alright um, 